Shield has fallen since the last Captain America, so now we're all kind of relying on one another. There's really no one to report to, so it's kind of this loose hierarchy. They're, they're kind of just uh, leaning on one another as soldiers. There's no one person giving commands, but, uh, but we're kind of operating as a true group now. He's trying to still figure out where he belongs, you know. He's, he's always been a soldier. Um, he's always kind of fit in that format. He, he enjoys structure and he enjoys having orders and a plan. Um, and without that, uh, he, he does feel a bit aimless, but he is still searching for whether or not um, he can have a life outside of being Captain America. He's been of service for so long, uh, trying to figure out what he would do without his uniform and shield is, is a bit of a puzzle. With Joss, I mean, he's, he's not just our director, he's our writer. So, so that level of involvement that he has with these characters and this material is um, incredibly uh, beneficial. You know, if, you, if you're struggling with a scene or if, with, with a line, um, he's not only phenomenal uh, at, at coming up with things on the spot, very witty, um, he, he has wonderful banter and repartee, so he can always make adjustments, but he's a comic book fan. So um, one of the main demographics you're trying to uh, please, are, are, are the fanboys, and since he is one, uh, it's a very safe uh, exchange, knowing that anything he suggests will be met with approval. I thought it was great. I mean, they're, they're, they're a unit now, so it's not growing pains anymore. It's, it's now just kind of internal conflict, um, trying to operate as a team, as opposed to how to form one. I think he, he's certainly giving the orders, um, but it's not the type of hierarchy where he gives commands and people have to do it. This is purely in the sense of when battle breaks out and we need structure, Cap has no problem kind of organizing a team approach. Um, in terms of how they behave when we're not fighting a foe, there still is you know, a loose chain of command. No one is technically in charge, um, but, but Cap certainly does lean towards the side of structure and, uh, you know, uh, a hierarchy, so so when they're on the battlefield, I think is when he feels most comfortable. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey, you guys.